Hi, today I'm going to show you how to draw a quadratic graph using the table of values key on a Casio scientific calculator. So let's have a look at the example then. So we've got to draw the graph of y equals x squared minus 2x from x equals minus 3 to x equals 3. So as you can see I've already drawn out the little table and we just need to work out the y coordinates uh, from this formula here. But we're going to, actually going to cheat and use the table of values key on the Casio calculator. So to get the table of values uh, up on your scientific calculator, press mode and you want the table which is number 3. So press 3. And you'll see this F bracket X come up. Now F of X is basically Y. Okay, so that is the same thing as Y. So we're then going to use the alpha key here to type in X squared minus 2X. So if we go alpha and the X is on the right bracket key, then we can do squared and then we've got minus 2 alpha x. Okay, so we've typed in our quadratic now, so hit the equals key. Okay, and you'll see it'll say start, and it's got a number 1 in. Uh, this is where you want to start from with your x coordinates. So we want to start at minus 3, so if we over type this and just put minus 3 in, hit the equals. And we want want it to end at plus 3, so if we hit the 3, again hit your equals. And the step size is what the x values are going up in, so we're going up in 1s. So it's already set at 1, so if we just hit the equals key on that. And as you can see now, we can see the table of values, which has been worked out. So when x is minus 3, um, the y coordinate, which is the last column here, is 15. So we can fill that one in. Second one, when x is minus 2, uh, the y coordinate is 8. When x is minus 1, the y coordinate is 3. So if we just scroll down now, uh, so when the x coordinate is 0, uh, the y coordinate is 0. When x is 1, the y coordinate is minus 1. When x is 2, the y coordinate again is 0. And the final coordinate when x is 3, the y coordinate is also 3. So once we've got our values worked out, we then can plot the graph. So let's just move the calculator out of the way. So at minus 3, the y coordinate was 15. At minus 2, the y coordinate was 8. At minus 1, the y coordinate was 3. At 0, the y coordinate was 0. At 1, the y coordinate was minus 1. At 2, the y coordinate was 0. And at 3, the y coordinate was 3. So we then just need to do a neat curve going through the points. And there you have our graph for x squared minus 2x. Thanks for watching.